I mean, I haven't got pictures in, in our flat because of that mirrored wall I've got. Yeah. Right? Uh, so, I mean, it's tiny. You've been in it. Got windows on one wall, door to get in on the other, kitchen on the other, mirrored wall on the other. <laughs> so there's no nowhere there. There's no, no space for art. I'm intrigued how you sit at home. Uh, what's the, where's the where's the sofa? At home. Yeah. Facing the mirror. So you sit yeah. looking at yourself all night. Yeah. As opposed to a, a painting. Yeah, but at least that changes each day. No, it doesn't. It does. The picture no, no, changes. it's not. It's round and miserable every fucking day. No, no. Honestly, it's it's good to because you don't look at yourself otherwise. Especially me, I haven't got any hair to comb or anything, so I don't look in the mirror as much as the normal person. So, whereas now. I'm looking there every day. So you're sat at you're home staring at yourself? No, because the telly's in front of the mirror. But are you not so distracted by yourself? Yeah, you do. You? When the adverts are on, you look up. And if Suzanne's sat next to me, I tend to talk to her through the mirror. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? So why don't you look at her when you talk to her? Well, you, don't, you don't have to turn your neck or anything. There's no neck usage going on. I can just look forward. I look at the telly, lift the eyes up, look in the mirror, look at me, look at her. <laughs> Look back we're, at you we're used to it. That's that. There's nothing wrong with that. It's, it's like there's more people in the room in a way. It's like, <laughs> and they're further away. There's nothing odd about that. Why wouldn't you use? It doesn't matter. Your Sorry. Eyes, remember, why your eyes wouldn't are still... you talk to your girlfriend via a mirror all the time? Is that your question? Well, no. I think it's quite normal. If your head is facing a mirror where you can see everything in that room, remember, it's a small flat. I can see everything that's going on in there without moving my head. Stephen <laughs> Hawking would be well happy. <laughs> So I can look forward, she's sat next to me. If, if I'm watching the telly, I can say something. Now, she's getting the sound from me still, because she's sat close. Yeah. But yeah, we're further away, but things look better from a distance anyway. <laughs> so that's how you managed to you keep are, this relationship alive. You are just, you're such an odd little man. But no, yeah. it's, it's not odd. You see, there was a woman on, on the estate who, who did use... Have I told you about Miss Peggy before? No. It rings a bell. Go on. I'm going to tell you ages ago, it's this fat woman who used to be on the estate. She had a three-wheeler bike. <laughs> and what, her husband's... Push bike? Pedal bike? Yeah, like a tricycle thing, yeah. but a big one. Right. She used to sit her husband in the basket in the back. <laughs> cycle about, what have you. Yeah. She was known as Miss Piggy. Anyway. Oh, is this the one that she used to beat him up so your dad pretended to be a policeman? Yeah, yeah that's it. Anyway, well, the way she used to communicate, she used to always go in quick save and nick biscuits. And if anyone went up to her to say, stop nicking the biscuits, she'd pull out, like, a little mirror out of a bag and she'd look in it, but talk to you via the mirror. <laughs> oh, God! Oh, man! What, what, what? This so she was insane. Up, it's weird, isn't it? It's it was like, really weird. Like it used to scare yeah. me. It's like, it's like a Salvador Dali painting. <laughs> you, you exist in there. Yeah. It's really, really so, weird. So, hang on. So, she used to talk to people through the mirror because she was mental... I can sit, watch the telly, and look at me watching the telly in the mirror all night. No, that's weird. No, that would Why? be really weird. It's really weird, Carl. Oh. I'd be very conscious of myself. No, it, I think it gives, you, it gives you confidence in that. And if you are, it gives you confidence. Of, well, yeah, because you're seeing yourself more, and you pick up what habits you do and stuff like that. So, what have you changed through your viewing uh, of yourself? I, I, I sort of grew grew a beard the other week, just something different to look at for a bit. And then you get sick of that, it's like a piece of art. Change that, have a bit of a shave. Can you see the back of the telly in the mirror? A little bit, yeah. If the flat's a mess, it's a mess twice. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God!